Welcome back, my friend, to another reaction video. Hope you're having a good day. And if you're not, I hope it gets better. This video is from Body Cam Watch. That's what it's all about. Let's go. On March 10th, 2023, deputies responded to a trespassing call involving an unpredictable male. You don't live here. Yes, I do. No, you don't. You don't live in. here. Because you called me for a well-being check last week. And you didn't make it. I did make it. Then why didn't you call me back? Because she's already spoken to you. I'm out of here. Alright, you're being trespassed. If you come back, you'll be taken to jail. Okay. Thank you, sir. I'm a carpenter, bro. Okay, kick rocks. I'm starting my own company. Kick rocks. Any other main custom carpentry. He's highly underrated. I believe he's going to be taking a tenant here now. He's trying to find my keys. You're fine. Find your keys. Come on. The faster you get out of here, the faster I don't have to deal with this shit anymore. Keys. Okay, then walk. You're being trespassed. I'm not trying to hurt you, dude. I just want to ask her to marry me. That's okay, she doesn't want to marry you because she wants you trespassed. But I may look like bad, man. Just trying to give her her stuff, dude. Just relax. Okay, I'm not doing anything wrong. 54, he's not aggressive, he's just agitated do, right? extremely. I'm moving out. I don't want to live with her anymore. I don't want to be married anymore, okay? Okay. That's it. So okay. don't shoot me or anything shit like I that. I don't plan on shooting you unless you do something really, really stupid. What would I do? Come at me. Why? Because you're extremely agitated. No, All I asked you to do is leave. I'm happy as fuck. I just got a new job. Fantastic. Well, let's go be happy somewhere else other than here. And I found this badass gun. It's a rigid. I was going to give it to my son. My bachelor party, dude. Okay. Are you gonna look for your keys or are you gonna walk? Which one? Thanks, Steve. Don't walk up on me. Walk away. What? Walk away. Why? You're being trespassed. Why? All my all my shit's here. You, you don't just got live trespassed. here. You don't live here. Yes, I do. I live no, right you here. don't. I was out here last week. Five years, bro. You don't I live here anymore. This property. Okay. Take a deep breath and calm down again. Don't arrest me. I don't plan on arresting you unless wrong. you stay here. I'm not doing nothing wrong. Don't arrest me. Alright? I just gotta put my son's stuff there. Alright? I'm joining the fucking army. I'm out. Okay, I'm gonna ask you a serious question, right? Do you play games? The reason I'm asking you this is because if you ever played a survival game, you know when you start the game and you start walking up to like a certain area and you see a man without a shirt just little shorts where they start off on with no shoes barefoot like this man and they come up with you and they're acting weird and you're playing that survival game you know something's gonna go down <laughs> either he's gonna try to attack you or you're gonna have to attack him and that's what i'm seeing right here man this dude ain't got no shirt no shoes acting like he just started and started living in a car because he survival is the end of the world Camping outside this house, which is his ex-girlfriend, talking about he wants to just, you know, propose to her. I don't know how he was going to say, I mean, i never seen a person propose to somebody they love without a shirt, shoes or nothing. At least they should put on a nice shirt, you know, some nice shoes and stuff and get some flowers. I don't know how it works, man. You know what I'm saying? But I don't think it works like this, you know, without a shirt and shoes. What? And then he says, never mind, he don't want to, like, marry her anymore and stuff like that. And he lives there. I guess he lives outside on the property, on, on the truck or something. That's, that is dangerous for the person, for the woman. That's, that's no longer an ex-boyfriend or whatever. That's a stalker. That's somebody that should be trespassed for real. It's like, it's happening here, but he's not understanding that. They probably have to arrest him and take him to jail. But, you know, some people just love somebody too much that it turns into some crazy idea in their head. They have to be with the person. It's like, no, it's not like that, you know? Yeah, if I was that police officer, I'd be ready to take out my pistol, man, because this guy, 
already doing stuff he's not supposed to like approaching him trying to handshake him like you're my friend now dude you know <laughs> what all right that's enough man but let's get back to the video but i just want to point that out man this is very no problems fantastic no problems officer i don't want any problems She's the problem, not me. Bruce County won't hear about this. Half of this is Volusia County. This is Lake County. But down there's Volusia County. Down there's Lake County too. But down further is Volusia County. You gotta go about 10 miles down 44. Start pushing me then. I'm not pushing shit. You can get out or you can go to jail. What? You can leave or you can go to jail. Those are your options. How am I gonna leave? You got two feet that work just fine. You've been walking around here the entire time. You can call a tow truck for your property. Pull that gun. I'm not pulling my gun. My hands are on my chest. You're fine. She tried to shoot me. She smacked me in my fucking house the other day. Did you hear about that? Where was that at? Pearson. Did you call the police? Yes. Okay, did they file a report? No. Because she said I made it up. I don't work what for is Pearson this Police. What you say I'm making shit up for? What are you yelling at me for? Because she's lying to you, dude. Listen, dude, I haven't even talked to her. What's I came out and did your well-being check last week. I know you don't live here. You've already lied to me and said you do live here. Do live so here. I'm going to give you two options now. Oh, and one, option one is to leave. Option two is to go the f to jail. Ooh. I can do it. Try my shit. Get the f out of here. I, 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 I. Like, give me the channel. About to go down. That's what I'm talking about, survival mode. Well, that mess. Don't even clean it up. Ryan, he just tried to jump out of the truck and run at me for a second. I had him at taser point. He's jumping back in the truck, moving around. We can trash that later. Mm -hmm. Just go with my son, dude. You need to get out of here, like now. <laughs> Ryan, he just grabbed a nail gun. With your right hand, roll the window all the way down. Roll the window all the way down. Roll the window all the way down. Roll the window down. Slowly open the door. Slowly open the door. Don't tase me, please. Please don't tase me, dude. Don't tase me. Open the door. Face away from me! Let me see your hands! Face away from me! Step out of the vehicle! Step out of the vehicle! Don't tase me, please. Step out of the vehicle! I'm really scared, don't tase me. Step out of the car! Don't tase me, please, dude. Don't tase me. Don't tase me. Please, 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 please. Please don't. I'll leave. I'll leave. I'm leaving right now. Step out of the car. I'm sorry. I'm step sorry. out of the car. Last me. warning to step out of the car. Face away from me. Don't tase me, please. Don't tase me. Face away from me. Uh, Taylor, you need to step out of the car uh, and face away from me. Now. Don't tase me, please. Uh, yeah, uh, Taylor doesn't realize that the police officer is not holding a taser, you guys. I just want to point that out. It went from taser to lethal. I'm just saying, John. And another thing, I don't know if taser's okay. 
he seems either he's on something or he's just not okay. You know how there's some people that need to be in the hospital because uh, they got problems like and they can't control themselves uh, acting on whatever they're thinking or wanting. Like he wants to be with the girl even though the girl's on her to leave and he's making a mess in her yard. She even say, why you thought you don't stop in my yard? And I was also thinking like, wow, that's a lot of stuff in the yard, you know. But yeah, now I kind of think, I don't think he's all there you guys do that or he's just very very weird person you know you know what i'm trying to say man i think he needs to be in a hospital because i don't think it's okay i think he's gonna even though this guy i think he's gonna come back keep on messing with that with the girl man that's not that's not cool just putting that person or any person in, in a situation where they can't even sleep because they'd be wondering if they leave their house and they're coming back, a person might be there hiding, waiting to jump on them, you know? Scary stuff. Movie, movie scary stuff. But, yeah, he don't realize it ain't no teaser no more. Okay, now, let's get back to the video, man. That police officer's doing his job. Please don't tase me, please, 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 please don't. Place your hands behind your back. What I do Place your hands behind your back. Do not move. Do you understand? Do you understand? Yes, sir. Look, he's the tent. You can clear it. Don't tense up. Sorry, 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 sorry. Stand up. Sorry, 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 sorry. Stand up. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just trying, to get, my, I'm just trying to get my son some stuff. That's nope. all. Stand up. It's his birthday. You can walk over here now. It's his, it's his birthday, dude. That's all I'm trying to do. Okay, well, you're done f***ed up now. Why? Really? Grabbing a nail gun and pointing it at me is no, a mistake? No, I didn't. I was trying to give it to my son, buddy. That's not what you did, bud. I was trying to give you it to my son. You opened that bathroom door and pointed the nail gun no, at I me. No, I did not. Don't it's not even, tense, no Don't tense up. Why are you doing, dude? Why are you doing this to me? Because you pointed a nail gun at me. I did not, me. buddy. You did. I did not. I watched you do it. I did not. You're a liar. I'm not lying. You're lying. I watched you do it. You're lying. All you had to do was leave. That's it. That's all I'm doing is leaving. You weren't leaving. You were pushing stuff out of the car after several times I told you to leave. I just wanted to give my son his birthday gifts. That's all. I'm just trying to say bye to my son. I'm, I was going to go join the army. There's a nail gun in the passenger seat. He it's started pumping stuff. Gun. It's for my son, dude. It's he for, started pumping stuff. Shut up. He started. Why? Hey. Nah. Relax. He started it's dumping stuff. Son, Relax. Yeah. Relax. Relax. Nah. Uh, he started dumping stuff out the passenger seat. I'm fine. I'm fine. When I came around the corner with my taser, he pointed that nail gun at me. Hey, did I tell you to get up off the desk? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just she freaks me out, dude. She always takes my son and makes me freak out. I don't know why she keeps doing this to me. You got anything that's gonna poke me, cut me, stick me, stab me? No, dude, I don't do drugs. You got any razor blades, knives, anything like that? No, man, I don't think so. Roll up around to your right side. Sit up. You're getting ready to stand up. I told her she does this every time. She makes me freak out and she takes my son. You guys take me to jail every time. I'm just gonna be. See it clear? I'm perfectly fine, dude. Thank you, double lock. This is what I'm trying to do. Thank you. I'll clasp your hand for me so I can do it. So, yep, you're good. Thank you. Oh, God. Right, there you go. Thank God. I'm fine. Right, have a seat. Well, I'm only free from her, dude. She's such a horrible Get person. The vehicle. She's such a horrible person. She's so a vehicle. She takes my little boy away all the time. There's no reason in for it, dude. Let me. Sorry, I'm okay, no. You guys see? You see what these f do to people? I didn't do anything wrong, but I was just asking my son's mother to marry me. That's it. That's all I asked to do, and look what they did. They locked away and put away the key. I did nothing wrong to anyone. I'm a preacher. I was gonna marry her and her new girlfriend. That's all. The well-being check, she said this isn't the first time. When I did the well-being check, she said it wasn't the first time. Okay. So I'll uh, photograph this. I'll go as far as even getting a statement from her real quick. Um, see if she wants to do it. Okay. Nah, nah. All right.
We'll walk down here a little bit in the shade. I like the shade a little bit more. Oh, yeah, I had my adrenaline going. <laughs> uh, me too. Not every day I get a nail gun pointed at me. No, I really was going to ask her to marry me, but well, apparently that didn't go over so well. Oh, well. I'm going to be suing these guys anyway, so I'll be pretty rich. Everything was fine. It was great. And then he just has this mental snap, and I don't know what triggers I, I remember you said that last time that he has mental snaps. It's all about balance, people. You got to balance yourselves. You don't need to use drugs. You don't need to do anything. You don't need to get a weed card or any shit like that. Like, smoke some cigarettes and have a beer every once in a while. You don't need to smoke drugs. 31, Every time that she does that, I get calmer and calmer. Every time. This is the last time I'll ever come over here. What's your name, officer? Deputy Clark. Deputy Clark. Deputy Clark, you are now officially uh, being sued. Whoa, he got that cheddar, man. He got that money, money. Maybe you should call him, call him Money Taylor uh, uh, or something like that, you know? So let me get this straight. The, the woman had a child with the man, right? And then all of a sudden, one day, he just snapped. Like he don't, he said he don't do nothing. He don't consume nothing that's bad for for his mind. So he's he, he needs help, you know. And un, and he blames the woman for for taking the child away from him. But then he's outside, like camping outside her place, even though she keeps getting him into jail because that's what he's saying. He still wanted to marry her. I don't know if the, how that works. You know, he's saying maybe. I don't think you, somebody don't want to be with you. I don't think they would want to marry you. I'm just trying to like, in case you're thinking about doing something like him, you know, like maybe you got a person you're in love with from like, I don't know, high school or something like that. And they really never paid attention to you and try to marry them. I don't, or I don't think it's going to, I'm just trying to help you out. Look for somebody else, you know? But yeah, he, I think he did like, like the police officer told him so many times just leave and he kept on like going on a side quest or something you know instead of taking off if somebody police officer came to me and i was acting a fool hopefully i'd be like okay police officer thank you for giving me a great advice oh Yo, you just changed my life i'm i'm gone <laughs> never coming back yeah um but saying that though i mean this guy needs help and honestly the way he is he should, probably should not be near the, the female and, and the child until he really need get some help he's not on nothing or on something he's clearly shouldn't be around but there is i'm saying this because i know i have friends here in mexico that have children and they were with somebody like uh the mom they separated and then the mom made another man and the man didn't want the real dad to be around anymore so they like try to do anything they can keep the husband i mean not the husband but the real dad away and it sucks for them you know because it's pretty hard for for uh the father to try to be with or see the child because the mama decided to be with somebody else the person doesn't feel that anywhere close to the child you know and it's really harder in like third world countries second world war countries you know uh so i'm just saying this not saying that the females don't that, you know but there's a case out there, man. You probably know about it. But this man, yeah. He shouldn't be around. And then now he's in a suit. You got that money, man? Oh. <laughs> yeah. I'm just saying. I don't know. What do you think? Maybe I'm wrong? I want to press charges on him right now. I know my acts. I know the Baker Act rights. I know everything. You're not being Baker Act. You're a place of arrest. Why? I created the soul of law enforcement. I didn't touch you. Assault, not bad it's all in your body cam, dude. You don't have a case. Your What's that? Your have a oh, he's gonna have a great time because I think you're pretty rich, aren't you, Chitwood's son or something? Is Are you Chitwood's son? No. Oh wait, that's I'm, I'm Chitwood's son. That's right. I'm a Volusia County Sheriff, bro. I was just going down there to sign up. Call Ron Skipper. You're not going to jail? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you're going to jail, dude. 
Ten four over and out. Roger that. Do you feel threatened by him? No, I would smash his face, like without a doubt. I do not feel threatened by him, but he's unpredictable. Police brutality! Oh, police brutality! That's a joke of me. If I was that officer, I definitely would have tased him, for sure. Like, oh, yeah? hands down. Florida man. They, fi they finally got Florida man, dude. They finally got Florida man. Damn! Hopefully there's some cute uh, girls in there working. I like girl cops. Pretty hot. Ain't not, again, nothing on military police. Marine MP, PIM to the MP. I used to be a hero, but now this cop made me a zero. He's gonna get sued for a zillion dollars to a trillion to a rear row. This cop's getting sued for a lot of money because he thought it was funny to arrest me in front of my kid. But it caused me mental damage, destroyed my frontal lobe. Now I don't know what to do, I'm going in the strobe. Woo, he had some bars. All right, yeah, clearly. He, he needs help. I mean, he he was talking about Baker Act, you know? So he's probably being involved in that, or at least put in that before. So, yeah, because he said he, he had his new his rights or something like that. Another thing, didn't he say he was going to go, like, he just wanted to give presents to his child because he wasn't going to the Army? Not the Army, but the Navy. I don't, know, I don't remember his name was Trevor or Taylor, uh, Taylor or something like that. I don't know, something like that. But yeah, I remember him saying he was going to Navy, but now he busted out with a bullet. He wasn't going to be an officer. Like he 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 changes his stuff a lot. And I, wow, did you guys see that invisible person choking him, making him? You know, that's why you're saying police brutality. I felt that man. he was. Ooh, he was the, yeah, very very. I felt it. What they did. And uh, yeah, I was like when that girl said, "I would just smash his face" or something like that. I'd be like, "No, you don't want to do that." Unless he, I guess, some sort of the property and he's trespassed. I guess she has the right to, like, it's her property, right? Which I hope she don't have to ever do that because, I mean, she does have a child with the, with the man. I don't think the child would, like, have that in his life. Like, yeah, oh, my mama doesn't smash my daddy's face, you know? But then again, if he knows how the daddy is, I don't understand. But besides that, man, he was about to, you know, to get engaged with the woman and then he got to the police station and started seeing two other women that they were pretty hot i don't think he would be a faithful man i'm just saying you know oh i hate to laugh but some people just it's so entertaining i hope he does get help though he seems like he needs to be in somewhere for a while to get some help especially so he can help himself help his ex-girlfriend that has a kid with her uh be safe by staying away, you know, by understanding he can't be near or something. You know what I'm saying, right? Anyways, what did you think about this video? Let me know down below. Also, thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. Hit the like button because it really helps this video and channel out. And because of you hitting the like button, YouTube will suggest this video to other people never seen before. And I really appreciate it because that's the best way to help the channel. And uh, you want to watch another video? You can watch this one right here. I will see you next time. Bye.